hello, my favorite paint by number enthusiasts. I know you guys never see me in person and it's because I'm looking out for your best interest. <laughs> So this is me with makeup on, but without it, it is not so pretty. So I just don't do my paint by number or diamond painting videos or even my chalk couture videos with my face. But today what I wanted to do is just a quick intro to what today's video is gonna be about. I wanna start doing a series on the trusted paint by number sites and trusted diamond painting sites um, each month because I feel like with the pandemic that that has changed so much from month to month and who I trust this month is not who I trust next month. And some of the ones that I've brought to you before now have kind of dropped the ball big time uh, during this pandemic. So I want to maybe make this a series where every month I come to you and I say, okay, this is somebody else that I like, or this is somebody new or, you know, whatever. So that's kind of my plan. A lot of you guys have really kept my uh, confidence going lately with everything that's going on at the group. Um, I just appreciate you guys so much and that y'all care for me like you do and you trust what I have to say. Um, I didn't do these videos because I know it all. I did these videos because it took me a long time to figure out some of these things that I've learned. I just appreciate you guys, you know, having faith in me and, and just... I don't know, continuing to watch and to subscribe and all that. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna switch you to paint by numbers and not to this, but I did want to kind of talk to you guys face to face because I just don't ever get on here and do a paint by numbers video or a diamond painting video and you actually see who you're listening to, I guess I should say. And we're going to talk about my favorite trusted paint by number sites for the month of June. All right, I'll be back. Okay, I'm back and I have my little stack of paintings to go through, but I am gonna give you some tips about how to avoid scams at the end of the video. So make sure you're watching for that. A lot of people will ask me the same questions that I've talked about in the video. So I know they're just skimming through, um, <laughs> which is fine, you have that option to do that. So the first one I have on top here is a painting by paintbynumbers.shop. Now I'm going to put the link in the description for every single one of these that I trust. Whether it's a legit or scam, I want you to know the difference. So be sure that you watch my video about where the description and where those links are if you do not know where the description is on the YouTube um, videos. So anyway, the Paint by numbers dot shop paintings have gotten some, you know, not great reviews lately. The company has nothing to do with shipping delays. If they ship the product and somewhere along the line in China or New York or Los Angeles or whatever, it gets delayed. I can't blame the company for that. That is totally out of their control. So all these paintings that I'm gonna talk about in these companies I'm not telling you you're gonna have them in a week. I'm just telling you that be patient, that they are legitimate companies and that you can trust that you will eventually get your items, okay? So this one, you can't even tell what it is because I've just barely started on it. Um, it is a world map and it's a watercolor world map, but that's not the important thing. The important thing is that I do trust this company. These come framed just like this, so they're already stretched. They come with the paints vacuum sealed, so you don't have to worry about breaking um, or leaking on the way. So during shipping, there should be no issues. Plus it's in a box. Each one is in its own individual box. And then those are put into a larger box and for shipping so that it keeps them very secure. So the first one I'm talking about, paint by numbers dot shop. Moving on. Masterpiece by numbers. This one is a US company. They also have a division in the UK, but I'm only going to be discussing, for the most part, the US companies because I don't have lists of Australia and UK and other, other companies and where they're shipping right now. Because we're in the middle of a pandemic, people's shipping policies have changed, that kind of thing. But if you're in the US, Masterpiece by Numbers is based in Florida. 
and they are literal masterpieces, you guys. These are paintings that are done by master painters and then have been converted to paint by numbers for those of us who want to have something that is a little more uh, challenging. All of their paintings, for the most part, are fairly challenging. They aren't the whimsical, cute, rainbow colors that we see a lot at other sites. These are actual artists who have given permission to have their art rendered as a paint by number. The quality of the canvas is great. Any painting you get from Masterpiece by Numbers is gonna be awesome. I get mine within about five to seven days and I'm in South Carolina. Sometimes it's even faster than that. I do know that for a while they've kind of put a hold on international shipping and so check with them before you, you know, order if you're concerned about it going overseas. All right, so Masterpiece by Numbers, legit. Some of you guys are very familiar with this painting right here. I have been working on this one and almost finished with it. And I have put, been posting it on my group. I'm still working on blurring this background a little bit, but this is probably my favorite piece that I've completed of all time. Um, the paints were beautiful. The colors, because they're purples and blues really did cover well. I only had to replace, I think this dark purple with my Arteza paints and I did that from the beginning. This painting is from Pink Picasso Kits. This one is also in the United States. I have not ordered from their website. I have ordered from Swoozies, but it appears that Swoozies doesn't have these anymore. I don't know if they're just sold out and they've removed them from their site or if they're gonna get them again, I don't know. But Pink Picasso Kits is who sells this one and I have a couple more um, zinnias and just really beautiful paintings. They do not carry the ones that we've talked about before, the little whimsical cutesy ones that everybody carries. They have botanicals like this and then they have a new line that's got some other designs. Um, but Pink Picasso Kits, because I haven't ordered from them directly, I don't know about their shipping time. I don't know anything about it. I can just vouch for the quality of this painting. Oh my gosh, love it. Favorite. My husband is so determined to get this one framed. He's like, okay, we're getting that frame. We're getting a frame. We're getting a frame. I mean, I'm like, okay, dude, okay, that's great. He wants to get it to my mom though, and I'm, I'm not sure I'm okay with that. Um, okay, so legit. Pink Picasso Kits is legit. So this one is a paint plot. You have not seen this one. I have not shown you guys this one yet. This is one that's in progress. You notice a lot of mine are in progress because I get a wild hair and I'm like, oh, today I'm gonna do this one and then tomorrow I'm gonna do this one. And you know how it is. So anyway, don't judge me. Uh, this one is from Paint Plot. Now, Paint Plot comes from China, just like 90% of the companies you found online. But Paint Plot is legit. Even during the pandemic, they shipped rather quickly and the reason i know they shipped is because i actually saw movement in the tracking after you know a few days if you see that somebody shipped it doesn't mean they actually shipped and i'm going to talk about that at the end when i tell you how to avoid scams um, but in the meantime paint plot since i first started with them and purchasing from them um i have noticed an improvement in their paint and their canvas and everything so I love Paint Plot. They've got lots of good variety of things you can purchase. Now, I know they're out of stock on a lot of their paintings right now. Y'all be patient. So, Paint Plot, you can trust. Legit. Oh, I should have mentioned, I have dry mounted this one. It does not come this way. It is just a plain old canvas that I've stuck on that dry mount board. All right, one you guys haven't heard me talk about in a while and I haven't actually ordered from them lately, but I've wanted to. Um, they have amazing customer service in my experience. I've had to deal with their customer service quite a bit just because I did um, a video for them once and they saw it and they were like, oh my gosh, thank you so much. Let's give, let me give you something for free. And it was really sweet because I did this video not having any intention of getting anything, you know, sent to me for free. Canvas by numbers, legit. Now, I contacted Frank. He said there's delays with shipping like everybody else that ships some stuff from China. So don't so, blame the company, like I said earlier, because you might bypass a really good company 
because you're so mad that it took six weeks to you know receive it. Um, we all have to expect right now three months delays for shipping. So if you have a problem when things are coming from China, don't order from China. Just just saying, the slow boat from China is slow. All the ones I'm showing you have been rolled when they arrived. You guys, if you're getting folded canvases, you are either buying from eBay, AliExpress, Wish, or some places on Amazon because they're the only ones who are folding their canvases. If you get it from a reputable website, and they're folding it, don't buy from them again, because that to me is just quality control down the drain. So all of these were rolled when I received them. Another one I want to mention that I do not have any paintings from, but I do know they're reputable, is Hirschners.com. It is also out of the United States. They have shippers, that's the brand, it's S-C-H-I-P-P-E-R-S, -S -E I believe is how you spell that, um, that are supposed to be very high-end, I don't know if they come on a canvas <clears throat> or whether they come on that board that people are talking about that's like a, I don't know, it's a cardboard or something, um, like paintworks and dimensions do. But anyway, Hirschner's is a good one and they have a variety of different companies that they sell for like dimensions and paintworks and shippers and um, a few others. But Shippers is a German company and I've heard really great things about them. I just haven't ordered, you know, any of their stuff yet. But Hirschner's is a website that carries all of those other companies. So they're a trusted site as well. Now, let's talk about some that have lost faith in. This one, you've seen me, this was actually just a canvas. It just came rolled from victoriasmoon.uk. I've stretched it for a video, so it is on a canvas stretcher bar, but it didn't come this way. I wanna say with Victoria's Moon, I'm, I'm on the fence. I used to love them. I love the little black tray that comes with it that holds the paints. I've had good coverage. I've had, I mean, everything has been a great experience in the past. Well now, since January, I have placed three or four orders. And do you know how many I've gotten? Goose egg, none but they have refunded my money each time. The only problem is they're holding on to my money for about a month before they're telling me, oh, here's your refund. You know, we can't get the, the materials, we can't get the whatever. So then, because I've trusted them in, in the past, they had a specific uh, collection and they put in the paintings that they could get for the time being. And you could pick three of those and you get buy two, get one free. So I went ahead and I said, okay, let's see how they're doing now. And I placed an order for three more. And this was about a month ago. Um, because I chose from the buy one, get one, or buy two, get one free collection, I thought, well, I'll get them this time. They should have plenty of inventory. They should have all the stuff that they need to ship this. Guess what? Two weeks later, I got a refund. So at least we're getting refunds from them. I mean, there are some companies right now that are holding my money and I am pissed. I mean, I could use some more harsh language, but I like to monetize my videos. <laughs> I'm angry, you guys, because I'm about to get to those companies, all right, at least one of them. Okay, so Victoria's Moon, I've loved in the past. I've heard that people are getting broken paints and leaking paints and paint sets that don't match their canvases and all that right now. People are struggling. These companies are struggling. So victoriasmoon.uk might make it back to my list next month for July, but for right now, I'm on the fence, okay? Next, I have nothing to show you for these last two that I wanna talk about because I haven't received my damn orders yet. I'm extremely angry about originalpaintbynumbers.com. Now, I think it's actually originalpaintbynumber.com. So, I have ordered from them a couple of times in the past. You guys have seen my Wings of Father, which is my Angel Father painting I've done. That is from them. I have also done the one where it looks like the man and the little boy are walking in the rain. It's like an oil painting. Um, I did that one from them. But... I actually have another shipment here from about a year ago with three other paintings or five other paintings from them. They have really good prices and whatever. But I ordered April the 3rd, 
seven paintings. So I spent about $75, $78 because I had a coupon. Um, so it was very reasonable, but it's not reasonable if you get scammed, you guys. So I'm not calling them out yet as a scam, but here's what I want to point out. They do not respond to customer service emails. They send you a generic standard email, which means somebody's on the other end of that sending it, but it is not a person. You cannot ask specific questions because they're gonna give you some, we are in the middle of a pandemic and we cannot help you at this time kind of crap. And they supposedly shipped my items after six weeks and that is not moved on tracking. So it still shows it in Shenzhen, China. Um, all seven paintings are sitting somewhere either at their warehouse or at the shipping station in Shenzhen, China. So right now, absolutely under no circumstances order anything from originalpaintbynumber.com. If they can't respond to a damn email that I've sent seven times, then there's a problem. Here are the tips that I'm gonna give you as to what to do in order to protect yourself from this kind of thing in the future. So I've written down some things I want you to remember. First, how to decide whether you think the company is a scam or not. So if you haven't ordered from them and you've not seen anybody else that's ordered from them and said anything about them, how do you know if they're legit? Because I have been screwed. There was a company in Canada that I ordered from. I loved their pieces. I waited probably two months and finally was like, yeah, I wanna go ahead and do it. I ordered from them and they supposedly shipped, which is what I'm gonna talk about, part of the scam, and then never got anything, never heard anything back, um, and all of a sudden their website disappeared. Okay, so here's how you're gonna avoid that right there. First of all, if it's a company you've not heard of and you don't know anything about, check all of their social media accounts. So on their website, it should have the little social media icons. If you click on Facebook, and they have nine likes. Step away from your computer. Do not purchase that item. If you go to their Facebook group and you see, you know, 15,000 people like it, join the group. Look and see what people are actually saying. Because let me tell you this, that company I got scammed from last year was, it had like um, probably 6,000 five-star and four-star reviews. They were bogus, y'all. They were fake. So that companies can do that. They can fake the reviews on their website. So if you go to Facebook group, you can generally get a better vibe off of whether they've got really good service or not. The other thing is, if they don't have a legit Facebook group, if you click that little icon and it takes you off into Never Never Land, go away. That's not someplace you wanna buy from, okay. Same with all of their other social media accounts. Click it, see if it goes to a legit place, see if it goes to a legit business. All right, this is gonna sound crazy. It almost sounds like I'm stalking these people, but I'm sorry, you about to get my damn money. You better have me some product and better not be scamming me. So here's, here's what else I do. Check their address. Check the address on maps. When I checked the address for that place in Canada after I ordered, it went to a motel, you guys, room 19 or some crap. So if I had known all these little tips in the beginning, I would have known better than to place an order from somebody whose damned address was a freaking motel room. All right, it may not be that obvious, but I literally go to the address they provided. I make sure there is a business there and there's an actual place. Now. If I ever start selling paint my numbers out of my home, you're not gonna see a business, right? It's gonna be coming from my home. But I will have a legitimate contact phone number. So that's the next thing. Check their phone number. If you have to call that company, call. See if they've got an actual customer service line. See if they seem reputable. If they're overseas, you know, I mean, I, I don't know. You can call or whatever, but sometimes um, the no address and the phone number being some, you know, out of order crap, which is what happened on mine. 
And that one was called paintbyartworks.com. Yeah, big scam. If you send emails, if they have an info at, you know, paintwithus.com or whatever, and you send them an email and you don't get a real person back within a few days, step away from the website. That's a big fat no. Attention to the reviews. Really pay attention. People don't just take the time to write crap reviews unless they've really been screwed. If you decide to finally just pull the trigger and order from a site that you're not sure about, pay with something like PayPal so that you have buyer protection. They will back your purchase. Now, sometimes it's a process. It might take a month from the beginning of the end to the end. You know, it might take a while, but you will get your money back. You're guaranteed to get it back. Now, for me, unfortunately, because I had ordered from original paint by number before, I did not use PayPal and my card will not let me file a report to get my money back. So those people are sitting over there with 70 something dollars of my money and I'm sitting here about to freak out um, that I'm losing my money. If, they, if the paintings come eventually, yippee. But if they don't, I'm screwed. I'm out, 80 bucks and I know better but it's because I had ordered from them before, so I trusted them again. Oh, lastly, if you're gonna go ahead and place an order from a company that you know nothing about, pay with PayPal, like I said, but only get one or two paintings. Because what if you buy six paintings and they're crap? You know, you get them and they're folded and they got junk paint and they're all dried up and they're all, you know what I mean? Like, oh my gosh, that's that would be just horrible. You waited six weeks and finally you get something that's junk. Uh, it just kills me. But, so just remember, you know, I know we are all very much OCD. I want it now. I want an instant gratification. I want seven of these paintings, but but like crafties, I could, I, I wanted six, eight, 10 paintings from there. And I thought, nope, just st start with, you know, one or two and see if I'm out money, I'm only out one or two instead of, seven or eight. So start small, order small, um, and there's, I'm sure, plenty of other companies right now that are reputable and trustworthy, but I personally don't know of them. Okay, guys, I hope this helped, and um, I appreciate you sticking with me through all this information. I will hopefully be back next month with another uh, series for July that is legit or scam. Okay. Have a great day. Thank you as always for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And that way next month you'll know who you can trust. All right. See you back soon.